chip.exe is a Visual Basic.net comprehensive CNC program, including source code, donated by Rick Cadell. Rick has been working in software developed for manufacturing systems for over 50 years and was very kind to donate this program. The user interface consists of tabs for G code, jog and probing, build, a tool setter screen, fixture offsets, diagnostics, program tracing, KFLOP C program setup, and overall settings. One of the main features of this program is support for ERP, Enterprise Resource Planning. This is a method or control and organization of everything involved in manufacturing a part. CAD files, G-code files, tooling, fixturing, operator instructions, etc. The build screen is involved with initiating ERP jobs. Projects consist of parts and subparts with associated files. Here, for example, the manufacture of a jewelry tray consists of some top-level CAD files and multiple sub-operations. The bottom operations consists of running multiple G-code files with the .chp extension. A route contains the sequence of steps. Once a route is selected, G-code files can be run by clicking on the Run G-code button. G-code files can also be loaded manually from the G-code tab. This is the preview window, and we can run the job. Speed hold, and cycle stop. There's also a tab for jogging. There's a diagnostic screen for homing. Buttons show the steps throughout the homing, also displayed up here. Internally, several C programs are used. One to initialize the system, one that chip sends command codes to perform operations such as go home, probe X plus, etc. One program for spindle control, and one for monitoring safety conditions. These are located in the PC VB examples chip KFLOP C programs directory. Some limited manuals and descriptions of the software architecture exist in the manuals folder. Internally, the software has a concept of handlers so that when a button is added, besides adding the button to a screen, most everything involved can be added in one place. Initialization, state changes, click events, etc. Unfortunately, the program is configured for a particular hardware type process and configuration. 
configuring for a particular system is somewhat involved and Rick Cadell is not available for support. We think with further development, this could be a good basis for a CNC operator interface. It also contains good examples of how to do things in .NET. Because the program was not developed by Dynamotion, we can only offer limited support. If there is sufficient interest, we can develop it further. Thank you.